I can't believe it's been a year since I bought the Unifira 12. So this is my one year review of the Unifira 12. It's easy to set up with the wood pellets. Once you've lit the oven, it's got a really big topper. They pretty much fall down into the grate as you're cooking. And if they don't, all you have to do is tap it and they will fall down. So it's really simple and quick to do. The chimney is very easy to attach. In the older uni ovens, there used to be a little clip and you'd have to sort of put it into a little hole. But now it's easy, you just turn it, it twists up and it's straight out of the oven. Great for carrying your pizza oven around. And that's another thing I love about this oven, it's lightweight and portable. If you are gonna be taking this oven away with you camping or for whatever, then all you need is to take a bag of pellets and a lighter with you. There's no carrying heavy gas bottles if you are packing light or you don't have much room. You don't need to use Uni brand pellets. I've settled on a brand, but I did a lot of experimenting. I think it's worth giving a few different brands a go in your oven. The Uni ones are really good though, and um, I highly recommend the Uni pellets too. The oven is very easy to clean, just remove all the ash once it's cool after the cook. Make sure that all of the holes aren't clogging up the grate because you will need that to ensure that you can light it for the next time. Keep all those air holes clean. Even though there is a small hole in the door to see what's going on, it's really too small and I can't see anything through it other than like a little bit of flame at the back. So I do not use that hole in the door at all. I have tried cooking with the door off. The flames kind of sweep to the back. If you like to see your pizza cooking and then you've got a door on, I just prefer to see my pizza pretty much all the time being cooked. I like the way you can store the pizza oven door right here. It's so useful, brilliant design. So if I get my oven too hot, which I have here, it's 518 degrees centigrade in the center of the stone. I use a cast iron pan to bring that temperature down.
So the temperature after the cook for cooking one pizza after another in the Unifira 12. We've got 356. So you're ready to go in five minutes with a full top up at the back. You're ready to go in five minutes for your next cook. Put that back on. First pizza oven I ever bought was the Uni 3 and that had a little hole in the side for you to light your oven with a gas burner because a few times my pellets have gone out. I've had to relight it without pulling the grate out. I've just pushed the gas burner through those that grid and it lights it back up again. And that's really handy but I'm not sure if you're supposed to do that but I'm doing it. But I would have loved to have seen that little hole on this oven exactly like the Uni 3. This oven gives the pizza a really good cook on the crust, not just the top of the crust, but all the way around the edges and near to the bottom as well. So it's given it a good all round cook. This pizza oven is super. It cooks really good pizza. If you are into smaller pizza ovens that cook pizza up to 12 inches, the stone can be removed for portability. It's very lightweight, easy to carry. The chimney comes off, it's easy to clean. And once you've got those flames going in the back with your pellets, then you're good to go and you can cook one after the other with it. There's so many good pizza ovens out on the market now. It's very difficult to choose which one is best for you. I think if I was starting from scratch and was buying my first pizza oven, I would have to be thinking about what fuel I'd be using all the time. And will I be carrying it around camping or traveling or will it be stuck in one place so it doesn't matter if it's heavier? That is something to consider as well. So I hope you found this video useful. Give it a thumbs up, smash the like button. Subscribe to support the channel if you did. Check out my shorts videos. They've just started appearing on my channel too. Take care. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.